Hey everybody, this is Marionette. Come back to you guys with another Storm King's campaign. Where last time we auto, well, we didn't auto resolve, we decided we would go above and beyond the Call of Duty and slash Wild out of here. Or whatever his name was, I can't even remember. Anyways, Durin did wonderfully, and then the program crashed and lovely stuff, so. It actually didn't save, so I ended up just auto-resolving it because I didn't feel like refighting it again. So, that's why we may or may not have fewer or greater troops. Anyways, what we're going to do is leave a couple of our guys behind. We're going to go over this way, and we're going to kill you folks. And... That's... Oh my gosh. Really? Ugh. Okay. Oh, I can work with this. To put it mildly, I've just pissed myself off. And it's... <clears throat> I really hate the... The way the AI decides to move, move things on the battle map. I just need to stop letting it do what it wants to do. It is annoying the shit out of me. Breathe. Breathe. That's the way games are played. They're meant to piss you off. Okay. I want my gold chevron boys to stay alive, so they're gonna stay back. Forever. The best. Okay, and we'll get the poor fellows moving in faster because nobody cares about them. Crossbowmen can move their butts as well. Wow, I did not even see them. They just walked right past. Durin, move in! Let's see, where are we at? Going in for the chopping block right here. And not even... Well, a few kills. There's a nice bit of charge. Look at that. Give that soldier a shining sword. Grant him the sword that was never given him. So that he may battle more of our enemies in such a gallant and noble way. But our men are winning the battle and forging a worthy victory. Wow, I am kind of disorientated right now. We are <laughs> and there, the enemy I say that, and we just kill the enemy general. The idiot to hell. <laughs> Screw what I just said. I know everything. Fuck all of you, I know what I'm doing. See? Exactly what I'm doing. Okay, where are we at with these swordsmen? Get some good volleys off, guys. Come on. Come on, that point blank range. Yeah, there we go. Over 10 kills? Oh my gosh. This guy's just routed. Wow. Completely demolished. How are we doing right here, boys? Not so good. Alright, pull back. Alright, we'll get twice the charging power. For half the price. Ha! <laughs> Look 
at that. We've we've killed over half their men with just crossbow power. Red eye. Aim. Fire. The enemy are badly blooded. They have lost Fools. Half their men. To think that you could face us and live. Unthinkable. How are we doing, boys? That's it. Kill them off. Kill them off. Nice and quick. What is this? Seriously? <laughs> I want to have a little bit of an experiment, fellow, fellow lords and lasses. Today, we celebrate the stupidity of the AI. For as they go for this one cavalry unit all the way in the back and waste a unit on the battle, I remain surprised at their stupidity. Okay, guys, just run them over. Come on. Come on. They're freaking levies. Let's go, guys. Come on. Come on. There we go. Nicely done. Okay, Durin, get over there. Bring your other other cavalry in. Let's see, let's get you stopping. And now we watch the fireworks. This is a quarter of their men. They left. Unattended. And we're just gonna... Well, give him a bolt to the face. Just peppering the crap out of them. Oh, this is just beautiful. B E A U T. Holy smokes! Look at that. I don't know about you, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't stand for this. <laughs> National AI Independence Stupidity Day. Praise the Almighty! Our enemy has lost his stomach to fight. We must push our advantage. Now, keep firing. Keep firing. There's still more of them alive. Kill them all. Okay, we're gonna speed it up now. Sorry about that. You know what? No, I wanted to watch them get shot to death. They deserve to die. And... What is the rest of this group? Oh wow. Well they're gone, so This is a clear victory. Now let's look at those crossbowmen kills. One hundred and one. Lord have mercy on them. Sixty four. Wonderful, wonderful man. I couldn't have done better my oh wait, I did. Huh. Did do better myself. Above death. Wow, the the mod creator love that. Volmont was just a made-up house to add add something to the to the mod. That was a great, great name or uh, phrase. Great, great phrase. Like it. I like it a lot. These fools can just go over to the Dorn Dornish men. I don't I don't care for them. This rebel army needs to get dealt with whether my man is a fool of a slow mover or not. You know what? You take some levies and that's all you get. Fight them. I dare you to win. I dare you. We'll build a watchtower right in the middle of the land here. And we're gonna move over to Rainhouse. 
Oh, never mind. Never mind. We are going to... We're going to stay where we're at. And we're going to just... Let them retry to take Mistwood. Unless we want to try and beat them with our 7 cavalry over there. <laughs> wow, I'm surprised they didn't do anything about that. Just gonna sit there. Dustin and Sunderland. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Not really, honestly. Let's see. Finally re recruit and retrain those guys. Jeez. Yes. We shall continue. Yes, my lord. Noble lord. With God's blessing right. and your orders. Is there any chance we could bring over some reinforcements? Not likely. Your orders, noble one. This is no your Oh, I thought they were bringing the that fleet back. Whatever. Get in Dirt City. Get to the chopper. Well, well, well. Now we just need to get to Estermont. Or Green... Yeah, it's Greenstone, I think. Greenstone, the final frontier. Okay, men. Yes. Move out. Command me. Your Majesty. Your Majesty. Order. Move out. Yes, my lord. Noble lord. With one. Yes. Okay, we moved to right there. We're not moving any closer. They might see us. Fools cannot escape us forever. We will find you, and we will kill you. Your brigands will bring you to justice. Whether you want it or not, we will stab a sword in your face. John Gower. Wonderful command. Why are you addressing me? And the Maiden Pool Militia is on the move. Quit that, you damn schooner! Your orders? We're well within the range. First, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Lord, yes. yes, my lord. Sail. Bless We've you. made it. Back on dry land. Men, Greenstone is here. This will be the end of High King of the Narrow Sea. Arkland the fourth? Yeah, I think that's the fourth. Unless I'm totally confused right now. That'd be sad. Anyways, we're going to siege their town. Well, we'll see if their prince attacks us or not. My gosh, your movement points. Oh. Durin, your father needs to get an exercise plan or something. Seriously, he needs to go on a diet. He needs to lose that infirmity. Just get more athletic. It's insane. Robert Durand. 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 Durandon. Durandon. Robert Durandon. It's about time you had some kids, man. Come on. Mooton and Massey. What is new? You know what, I could be cheeky and just, you know what, I could probably could just assault them right now. Yep. You know what, that's exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna kill them off real quick. They're totally outmatched, there's not a chance in the Seven Kingdoms that they could destroy me. Not a single damn chance. And I will not let them have a chance. 
and you want to know why? Because I said so, that's why. Alright. So, we've got just a cavalry unit, and we're going to send in a light infantry who's got spear type units. Probably send these guys instead. Those guys. I thought they had a ram. Never mind. Poor fellows. <laughs> Poor fellows, I feel so bad right now. Alright, let's do that. They'll guard our backs, and we'll have some crossbowmen. Either side. And the rest of the army can just sit on their ass and do nothing, so yeah. Alright, men. For kingdom and country, let us go to battle. You know, I was actually thinking about doing a campaign where you only get to recruit one one unit per turn and then as you kill off more factions each faction you kill off would allow you to recruit one more unit per turn so say if I somehow killed off the Estermonts this turn I'd be able to recruit two guys two units per turn not just one so I thought that would add a little bit of difficulty to a campaign and I was wondering what all of you thought about that. Just let me know down in the comments what you think. Whether I should try or should not try it for the benefit of your entertainment. Alright. Finally battering down the gate here. Battering ram is in place. It will not be long before our enemy's defenses fall. Okay, man. Move your butts. Our men have done well. The gates have fallen. We need to move. Okay. That's them. Fools, move. Okay, go, 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 go. And now we speed it back up. Give grace to God. We have captured the enemy's walls. All right. So they're just sitting in the center of the town. Well, castle like bumps on a log. Sad but true. All right, Durin. This is where you show what you're made of. More like your foot soldiers do that. All right, men. Go do battle. To battle. All right, our foot soldiers have made it. We're pretty much just going to defend the gateway from their own people. Unless there's another entrance. Well, shit. They're coming up the other entrance. All right, men. Fast maneuvers. Let's go, go, go. Okay, just everybody. Let's just let's just go. Come on, people. We're gonna have the poor fellows right there to block off their reinforcements, and we're going to have our good old pikemen get in there. These guys are gonna block off this alley as well. And this alley. Now we've got all of our choke points set. We will let them close in around us. Oh, this is gonna be so much fun. 
Eh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how much fun. But it will be fun nonetheless. Are they going all the way around? Are you kidding me right now? Wow, they went all the way around. You're, quit you're kidding me right now. The battle is in our favor. If we remain true and wholehearted, victory will be ours. Okay, well. This was a turn of events I was not expecting. Not expecting at all. Nonetheless, we will face it. Yeah, I kind of thought they would have uh, control of their own, I don't know, gate, so they wouldn't go all the way around. I guess that's too good for them. Yes, I know you can shoot us. Yes, I know you can do this. I just don't really want to care. Alright, nothing's happening, really. These guys are using their pointy little spears. Get them! Get them! We're gonna move our Leviathan for the Stormlands. Our favor. If we remain true and wholehearted, victory will be ours. Men, take up your oaths now. Fulfill them in every way. Oh no! Jerry just got cut down. No, Phil! How could you do that to Phil? That's right, you bastard. It's what you get for killing Phil. Jerry and Phil, you will be forever remembered. My lord! Our men are in <laughs> command of the castle! Alright, well, we've got 37 of them left. The blokes. Attack! They think they can kill off our good old poor fellows? I doubt it. How much longer do you think you can last against us? We have all kinds of cell swords in here. What do you got? You got nothing. You know what? You know what? What what am I doing? Just get these guys out here. Come on. Why not end this quickly so we can just blast through all these poor poor Pretty much a poor excuse for army layout, I mean honestly. Look at this. The enemy king lies at yes! Thank you! By our brave Scourge upon the earth is death. While his men mourn their loss. See? Why aren't they this smart? You tell me. And I will give you twenty dollars. Alright, finish off the cavalry and get the hell out of the square. We finish this today. Yeah, where are you gonna run, huh? If you route, where are you gonna run to, huh? 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 I don't know, do you? I don't have any freaking idea. Because you're alone. Your father is dead. Praise to our ah. Lord. Our men have slain the and as soon as he realized his father was gone... Or I guess it's not his... It might have been his father. Anyways, as soon as he realized his father was gone... Lost heart. He lost heart and let the sword cut right through him. Like paper. And they're they're routing. They're routing right now. I'm not leaving them. Screw the crossbows. We need to kill these fools. Whoa, whoa, friends, friends. I suppose I could win this, but I kind of want to just continue the battle anyways. Yep. That's how I feel. Oh wow, they got more. More soldiers for the slaughter. More men for the slaughter, eh? 
Wow, we've lost a lot of crossbowmen. I can imagine just killing more. That position, at least. Anyways, let us continue battle. Continue with what we were doing. Wave of fools and then leave. Leave our lands! You are our vassal now. Your leaders are slain. Your ways are finished. Look at that. Charge right through him. Beautiful. Durin just not giving a shit. Let's just go and fight. Fight to the end, friends. Fight to the end. Alright, we're done fighting these fools. Let's go for the second group. No more fighting. Throw down your crossbows or take us out to the face. They miss. Thank God. Alright. Fools, be warned. This is not for the light heart. Oh, he's still got some poor fellows left. <laughs> Practically all dead. How are we doing over in this choke point? No, oh, we're not doing too bad. Uh, poor fellows kind of realizing they're not going to live very long. You know what? Why don't we shake things up a little bit? And we will move our men over this way. Durin, why don't you get back inside of your new house? We shan't let one man get back to the square alive. Not one. Not a single man will get back alive. Not one single man. Men! Take up your vows now! We finish this! No, no, do not let him touch the square! Don't let it happen! Get him! Shit! For this you shall die, fool! You have no chance, no chance against us. Wait, who's shooting at us? Yeah. Yeah, who the hell was shooting at us? This is a clear victory that goes to well, only men of great virtue and valor. It wasn't that fun. That was great. <laughs> Most of it was Durin just slaughtering everything. Slaughtering everything in sight. Wonderful job, men. The first round's on me tonight. So everybody got drunk that night, and they feasted and drank to the death of House Estamont. And Greenstone was given to nobody, pretty much. Ransom. Nobody wants to ransom. I would have laughed if they paid that, because they're just going to die anyways. And... Influx. Nobility, and we win! Gone forever. Durin, the most prominent commander in the Seven Kingdoms. Just needs to, you know, retrain his entire mercenary army. You know, just, just because he can. Can we retrain anything? We can do that, and we will end our turn right there. We shall not lose again. Now that we've had have our old vassals under our heels again. Oh look at that. One of them wants to become our friends. No, we know you'd be traitorous. Get out of our sight. Anyways, what shall we do? Noble Lord. Durin, where there's those fools. Man, come on, man. Just fight the fucking brigands. It's like, really? Come on. 
You can practically do it yourself. Well, I think we'll just end the episode right here today, you guys. If you enjoyed, let me know down in the comments. And if you would like to see me do that challenge, I will go ahead and just start with this campaign, I guess. We're already at a good standpoint. We've just gotten rid of our rivals, one of them. And the next person we go to war with, we could practically just go with what we've got. I mean, you have it just makes me realize you have you'd have to be a lot smarter with your troops. So, that's what I would do anyways. Just let me know, and thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time. Very night out.